Cartoons can usually get away with a lot, and this is perfectly demonstrated in shows like Gravity Falls and Steven Universe, but there are times when the network just thinks that showing a certain episode will only be detrimental. That's why there are many banned episodes of cartoons that just aren't shown on TV. Today I'm going to be showing you guys 5 incredible banned episodes of cartoons, and please keep in mind this isn't a top 5 list, so there is no specific order of appearance. Press the thumbs up button on the video if you want to see more of these videos. Also, be sure to subscribe if you're new to my channel. Now let's get on to this really cool list. The first banned episode I want to talk about is from Dexter's Laboratory. Now there's two different episodes that were banned, but I'll be talking about what I think is the more interesting one. Dexter's Rude Removal. This episode was intended to air in the second part of season 2, however this was not the case. In the episode, Dexter invents an interesting machine called the Rude Removal System. It's a machine to remove the rudeness of his sister, Dee Dee. Dee Dee thinks that Dexter is the rude one, so they fight and then both end up in the machine. It activated, creating a pair of clones that just use curse words all the time. Throughout the episode, they go around cursing their parents and then the real Dexter and Dee Dee try to stop them. There's a lot of swearing in this episode, even though it's completely censored. You can usually tell exactly which swear word they are using, which is probably why Cartoon Network decided not to air this. Since this was a much different episode than the usual Dexter's Laboratory episode, kids might feel scared watching it because of all the swearing. One interesting fact is that this episode was nowhere to be found for a very long time, and it was basically just a myth. Nobody really knew if this was some sort of creepypasta type episode where it was never actually made. But recently, it was uploaded on YouTube and many other places online, so it's easy to watch the whole episode now. Look lady, that's cute and all, but let me tell you something, I make my own f***ing rules. So why don't you do what all good mothers are supposed to do and clean it up yourself? The second interesting banned episode is Peppa Pig's Mr. Skinny Legs. This entry on the list is particularly surprising because it's a show for the youngest of kids, and one should question what exactly would make the episode banned. When you're a really young kid, there's so many things to fear. The crew of Peppa Pig knew that a bunch of kids were scared of spiders, so they decided to help kids around the world. The lesson in Mr. Skinny Legs was that even though spiders look scary, they can't really hurt you. This message was good in Britain and many other places in the world, but things were a bit different in Australia. Australia is home to tons of creatures that can easily kill you, spiders included. Since the episode encouraged kids to go out and get up close with spiders due to their harmless nature, broadcasters saw a problem. In Australia, kids might get up close to spiders that could easily kill them, and that was a risk not worth taking. The episode was completely banned in Australia, however even though Australia is home to some of the most venomous spiders in the world, there hasn't been a recorded death from a bite since 1981. <coughs> Several episodes of South Park have been banned, and this makes sense since it has been on the air for a long time and it is a very controversial show. One of the biggest instances of this is the episode 201, which satirically addresses outrage over the depiction of the Muslim prophet Muhammad. During this episode, any image of Muhammad was completely censored by Comedy Central. There was a speech in the episode from Kyle, and it was honestly pretty depressing that this whole speech was censored. So Kyle's talking about how violence always wins, and he is referring to the fact that Comedy Central got death threats from Muslim extremist groups, so they decided to censor things from the episode. Comedy Central caved in and censored so much, ultimately giving in to the demands of these Muslim extremists. This episode is banned in several European countries, and it doesn't air on TV anymore in the United States. If you go to the official South Park website, you won't even be able to watch it. This next banned episode is one that you may have heard of, but it's still surprising how it actually happened. In one Pokemon episode, Ash needed to travel inside of a Pokeball. At one point in the episode, Pikachu used lightning to detonate incoming missiles, but at the same time, something terrible happened. While in the show, the day was completely saved, outside of the show, some kids were experiencing problems. The flashing red and blue explosion caused almost 700 Japanese children headaches, dizziness, or in rare cases, seizures. This episode wasn't just completely banned, it actually put the show on hiatus for four months. This event became known as Pokemon Shock, and those who went through it will probably never forget what happened. The last banned episode I want to mention is Ren and Stimpy's episode, Man's Best Friend. Now, this episode was originally supposed to air in Season 2, but was banned due to excessive violence. Ren beats up George in a pretty violent scene, which is the only reason this episode was completely banned. The director of the episode was actually fired from the show after this episode was made, and then later went on to create the adult spin-off of Ren and Stimpy. 
Eventually, Man's Best Friend aired on this adult spinoff, and surprisingly it had a TVMA rating. Be sure to give a thumbs up if you enjoyed, and comment below to let me know what you think. Subscribe for more awesome cartoon videos. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.